Okay, we have a Class C RB 2004 E450 Super Duty, and we've got these nice chrome pieces here on the uh, front wheels, but the back wheels look really crap. We came across these things, someone actually gave them to us, um, and they haven't fit perfectly. But the problem is that these studs on here are not long enough to come through the holes. Uh, through these two holes right here, unfortunately. So we found a company with lots of searching. Um, I don't remember what this darn place is called now, but let's have a look. Okay, where is it? Here we go. Here we go, Summit Racing Equipment, right there. Don't know if you can see that. But these guys had the part we were needing, which is pretty freaking awesome. Not only that, but they've got these cute little caps here, which go on the top. So I'm going to put those on now. And I don't really know what I'm doing. I think you have to put this uh, wheel. Uh, I can't remember what they call it now. Uh, but this has gone first. So let's have a look here. Like that, maybe. Here we go. You can see those do not quite reach, which was a little disappointing at first because we we're like, "Crap! What do you do? Like, how do you how do you use these dumb things?" But we have these extenders. Hopefully, I don't even know how to do this. Is it that way? No. It's okay. I think these have to go on first. <laughs> All right, let's take this off and let's put it down here. This is kind of trial and error. I think it was that. No, wrong way. I think it's going to go like that. I hope these fit. <laughs> oh my gosh. That would really suck. Like that. And the second one is going to go, hmm. Let's have a look here. It's directly across. So I'm saying, thinking that the second one goes right there. Like that. Sorry for the camera going off there, but. Okay, I may want to tighten those up, but I'm just going to check first if I've done it correctly. So I don't want to get them on and then find it doesn't, they're not on the right one, so let me check that. Okay, these are perfect. I mean, my gosh, look at that. It extends out beyond the uh, simulators, and so now I'm just going to go tighten them up. Let me go get a wrench. Okay, so we've got this um, half inch socket here, half inch. Thing, and we've got a size, what is that, size 27 I believe, yep, so size 27 fits pretty good. Now we're just going to tighten these things up. I'm going to have to pause this for a second. Okay, these are tightened up now, so we can get these caps on. Make sure it's good like that and all right okay these cute little things here screw straight on wow that's pretty cool I'll have to tighten that and there's a little so we've got the part number here that's what it is and then let's have a look at the part number for those smaller ones that's uh that's for the extenders all right there start another extension all right uh -huh. okay <laughs> this is hard to film and actually do it oh my gosh yeah, i need to change hands all right okay come on you can do it. Dang. Okay, I may have to pause this, guys. I'm sorry. Oh, hang on, no. I caught some teeth. Ah, I'm good. Okay, now we can tighten it up. Um, I think maybe this thing here should work. Okay, that thing does not work okay so I think it's just a matter of hand tightening them or finding like a bigger
kind of a socket or something. Okay, these turned out really good. They look great. So let's have a look here. Now the RV is looking much better. And we can do the other side now. All right. Definitely much better than that side. Okay, so we put this first one in and straight across would be that one. Okay, now I'm going to tighten it up. Let's have a look at the pauses just for a moment. Okay, all done. I'll tighten those a little bit later, but that looks great. 